I want it to feel real, raw, true emotions, you see? I mean, I get that, you just cannot use real meth. It's illegal, it's dangerous, and it could potentially ruin Arthur's life. I get that, I understand where you're coming from, but I don't want us to give up. Smithers, there is no chance. No chance, huh? Absolutely not. I like those odds. Hello there. My name is Smithers O'Neill, and I'm a filmmaker. I'm making this behind-the-scenes documentary for my meth musical called Meth, the musical. I'm uh, very passionate about this project, and I think it's going to be my magma opus. Fingers crossed. The reason I'm telling this story is because I think there's a definite gap between meth and singing that needs to be bridged. And when dealing with something like hardcore substance abuse, I wanted to show that even something as simple as the joy of singing can bring someone out of the darkest of places. Meth. Meth. That oh, that sounds, sounds fucking stupid. It's a film about battling your own demons and staying true to yourself. Something that means a lot to me. Uh, I've never dealt with any of this kind of subject matter like this before. I'm kind of just dipping my toes in the water. But let's just say I'm prepared to get my hair wet. Am I worried about the shoot? No. I haven't built any of the props or sets yet, but I think Smithers will buy into that I'm going for the naturalistic look. I mean, whatever. Bill. What? The fuck are you doing? I'm just saying hi. You just ruined the shot. I'm sorry. You just ruined the fucking shot. Get out. Get the fuck out. Sorry. That's my roommate, Bill. He fucking sucks and I hate him. I'm not taking out your- Take out the fucking trash. I'm not gonna take out your trash. Why are you hitting yourself, Bill? Hey, Bill! Hey, Bill! Bill, why are you hitting yourself? Hey, Mick, can I borrow some of your toothpaste? Does this answer your fucking question? Or Listen, how long, how long does the paper have to be? Five pages. Well, would here. you go talk to Wake first? Yes, I would. Here, you need this. Eat some salad. See you. Thanks. You serious? What? What? I'm totally cool with having a gay roommate. I'm no homophone. It's just when I walk in there and they're doing that touchy-feely shit, I'm not gonna stand for that. Fuck that. No! No! Not here! Whoa! Get out! Hey, what? What? What happened? So much PDA! Get out! Chill out! I have a Come fucking on. movie tomorrow, I'm not dealing with the shit! What's- what? what? Get out! What happened? Get the fuck- go sleep at Bentley's! It was Bradley. Get out! That- Come on. Get- I'm- get out! I gotta shoot tomorrow. Fine. Whatever. It was Bradley. It is Bradley. might look a little strange. It's a little thing called method acting. Now, me being a method actor, basically I'm putting my entire self in this role at all times, even when the camera's not rolling. And in my case, I'm a, a singing method. Basically, I put the meth in method acting. <laughs> It's, it's difficult, you know, the, the deeper I get into Boopy, uh, my character, uh, I just can't help kind of wanting to transform into him. 
Hi, uh, my name is Christos Luego. I'm a music major. Uh, Smithers has approached me with scoring his film out here, trying to gather inspiration. I, I, I don't like the, the term gather. I, I, it has a possessive connotation. I'm uh, trying to find trying to find the right energy, and uh, so far, you know, uh, the the vibes I've been getting, uh, a few few terms come to mind: uh, tranquil, soothing, soothful, and uh, which is a uh, kind of the opposite of, uh, of methamphetamines. Studies have shown that uh, music is the second most potent aphrodisiac behind ground hippopotamus kidney. And I uh, like to use that to my advantage. Uh, follow the female folk around with my guitar, play a little something for them. And uh, sometimes I'll uh, get a kiss or a phone number. Basically, I'm just trying to find someone who I, who I really connect to and, uh, who we, I can uh, I can make love to in fields of green, or if she has allergies, or bed. Well, I came here looking for some inspiration, but I'm afraid of heights and I can't get down. Yeah, I, I thought I was on pretty good terms with Mother Nature, but mothers can be cruel. I'm trying to make the best of the situation, you know, doing what I can. I decided to entertain myself. I would, you know make a mental list of every fruit I could think of. But I think I said kumquat like six times. So I might need to find something new. I'm boopy, let's do meth. <laughs> I'll suck your dick for meth. <laughs> I don't know, you know, I'm, I'm pretty open-minded and down to try new things, but I just don't see how this method stuff is working. It's extremely inappropriate and rude, and I'm just pretty embarrassed about this whole thing. Hey, hey, there's this guy over there. He actually wants me to suck. You know, should I do it? Would this help you get into character? I don't mind. I, I'll, I'll seriously do anything. No! We can't do that? Absolutely not. What the hell is wrong with both of you? Okay, okay. No need to get angry. Um, Arthur, tell him no blowjobs. I mean, I, seriously, I, seriously, I mean, I don't, I don't mind. No! I, I'm, 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 I'm passionate about this project. You know, I'll do anything. I really like Arthur. He gets it, you know? He's not afraid to go out there and show the world what he's made of. My producer, Jason, on the other hand, isn't quite there yet. Uh, he's got way too many boundaries. It's always can't do this, can't do that. No, 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 no. But uh, I'm really glad he's working with us, because I think he can learn something from this. Man, you were supposed to build the set and you didn't do shit. Are you wasted? Are you wasted? Listen, man, I'm not gonna get you in trouble or anything, but you were supposed to build the set, you've been telling us you've been doing it, and now the production is screwed. I've been getting pussy. Dude, give me that shit, man. No! Give me that! Give me that. Stop! Small and like, like small enough to hold and carry it around. Yeah. Give it, give it less. Well, uh, Smithers and I, we uh, we met about two years ago. It was uh, his mother's birthday. Um, I worked as a stripper back then. 
uh, was kind of interested in cinematography and uh, he came to me and he told me, you know, you need to find something else to do. Uh, so I called my parents and I told them like, Check, 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 pussy, pussy. <laughs> my name is Dante Bernard. I met Smithers about two, three years ago. He wanted me to be boom out for his movie. So, of course, I couldn't say no. I'm trying to get as much experience as possible. That's uh, interesting. We've actually never m met, per se. We shared a class together um, for a semester, and I looked at him across the room, and I decided that he was going to be someone who went places. And I've mostly just been admiring him from afar. Um, so I usually sneak my way onto his sets. I honestly am not even sure if he's aware that I'm working on this, if you can call what I'm doing working. But uh, I like watching him work. I like seeing him fail and succeed and learn. Overall, I think when he's done with this, he's going to... Uh, be ready to um, take me under his wing and mentor me. Give me the meth or I'll eat your elbow! No, not my elbow! I'm just not a fan of the dialogue. Cut. Cut. Arthur, you're doing great. But you. What is that? What is what? Are you a part of this world, or is this world a part of you? You my bitch! I make you my bitch! No, stop. I make you People my People say bitch. I have a strange directorial style, but my goal is to pull that raw emotion from the character. And if I feel like they're not putting enough in, I'll come in and pull it out of them. You like being spanked? Daddy gonna spank you! Stop, you're Daddy scary. gonna spank you hard! I guess some people just can't handle it. And you know what? In the end, that's not someone I want on my production. Not at all. Which shot is this? There are no shots. Only cinema. The shoot did not go well today. Not at all. My cinematographer left, and my producer has lost faith. And Arthur. Arthur went way too deep into character. He's left us. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Cut! I said cut! I can't cut! Cut! Matthew! You have to stop! I feel many things right now. But most of all, I feel hopeless. Feeling hopeless is a very powerful emotion, very powerful indeed. And that's just part of being an artist. You know, all the pieces can get strewn about, but it's up to you, the artist, light. to put those pieces back together and assemble them best. best as you can. And that's what I need to do here. That's what I need to do. So, uh, I got in trouble for, uh, being drunk in public. Now I gotta do, like, 25 hours of, uh, community service. It's pretty shitty and I hate it, but, uh, whatever. Um, I've been sober for three weeks now. It's been pretty difficult, but, uh, I'm seeing a shrink now, so that helps. So I'm friends with, uh, Bill and Bradley again. Where'd you get these glasses? Oh, uh... I don't know, I found them. Found them? Yeah. yeah. They're just on the ground outside. Today? Yeah. Oh, wow. They're good guys. Glad they're in my life. I uh, just wish they weren't, uh, weren't so gay sometimes. How's the salad today? Same. I mean, it's a calf salad. <laughs> Arthur's back, yo. Yeah, I've been like hitting the gym a little bit lately. 
trying to get back in that recovery mode. You know, apparently I got like this little tick or something, but I ain't really worried about it. It's not a big deal on my mind right now. Oh, check out this six pack. <laughs> the lighting really ain't right in here right now. I'm just back to my old self, really. I like to be free, but it's lonely in a tree, so I thought I would devise some company. See, you fucking bitch! Go fucking die! You broke my heart! Go suck a fart! Who am I? Who? Oh, I remembered. I'm me. I finally finished my album, uh, Who Am I? Which I think is an important question we all should ask. It's, uh, who am I? It's part of a kind of family of questions. Who am I? Who am you? Uh, who am he? Who am she? Uh, who am he, she? Because really, what's the difference? You know, and uh, actually, uh, I decided to give this album out for free because I feel like you know, our, our fetishization of, of uh, you know, uh, material objects is a, uh, is a beast that's been sufficiently fed, okay? I'm not gonna uh, give, give him a snack. I've been trying this new thing. It's uh, making love to a woman with my eyes. I think the, the carnal body gets plenty of pleasure, which is, which is all wonderful, but sometimes the soul needs a good roll in the hay, so to speak. So watch, like, like this, you see that? It's on the eyes. You see that? You watching? Guess what? Just made you fall in love with me. All right, so we've got a good act one and act three, but I think our act two is a bit weak. So what do you guys think we can do to, you know, move it on a little bit? I'm getting back on track. This time around, I'm going to come up with a good one. I just know it. People think I'm a great asset to the team. What if halfway <clears throat> through act two, Chad gets a sex change? I don't know. The sex that, change. That, I don't know if that'll really progress the story very well. And you know what? what about the Working with others has been surprisingly rewarding. <laughs> Who'd have thought? And it's just no one's hearing me and I feel like I'm trapped in a box and I just I just can't deal with this right now, all right? I'm just gonna have to... Oh, hey, I just hey, need to take some time and I just need to take some time. I'm just gonna be out here you. taking my deep breaths. What a faggot. What do you guys think about, you uh, know, um, the... You know, I've been called a great deal of things in my lifetime. Pioneer, visionary, maverick. What if he beer bongs a frog? And will I maybe some or all of those things? I mean... The only thing I truly am is an artist. That's actually not a bad idea. Yeah, I put that in after the food fight scene. I like it. Oh, cool. A really, yeah. really damn good artist. And you can quote me on that. Thank you.